Good morning. Hey, just want to do a quick on my Behind the Gaff with Jason this week. I'm going to do a walkthrough of our new space, showing you all the work that's been done, and kind of giving you another idea of where we're at and what's going on. Let me just flip the camera around here and show you. There's my flex. And here's the driving. Here's the big overhead garage doors and the regular man doors right here. So you can drive right up to the building uh, if you're picking stuff up and loading stuff out, which is going to be so great for everybody. You saw the last videos, you saw we had concrete floors before, and now we have hardwoods throughout. They look spectacular, and the lighting is here, getting ready to be installed to give these spaces new life. You also might remember that these walls were painted black, and if you have any questions, thoughts, comments, hit the like button, really appreciate that. Uh, but these walls were painted black, now they're white, which makes this room much more bright. And those walls were orange. Hey, Vonda. It is sweet. I'm so excited about it. Let me show you guys something else we're really excited about. <clears throat> we now have a dedicated, there's a two-car attached garage that we're going to put in a split unit in here. But we have an infinity wall to take pictures now. So we have some, you know, we have to address the lighting, obviously. Uh, and with the split unit, we'll be able to use this room all year long. But our furniture and larger pieces are going to be shot on this. We'll paint the floor white so that blends away. Uh, we're really excited to have a dedicated spot to shoot furniture at that's right in our facility, right? right in, I mean, it's right here. It couldn't be any better, any better really. We had to put in, uh, you might remember there was a single door there before because that's where we're going to do furniture and be in all there all the time. We had the double doors put in to just make it easier to roll stuff in and out. Thanks, Andrea. Appreciate that. Yeah, much better. Absolutely. It's going to be so cool. But here's the front room again. This was painted orange before. It still has the skylight, which we like. It gives a lot of natural light. And uh, again, you see the hardwood floors. They're dusty right now. There's still work being done. But they look and feel so fantastic. And up there, and uh, Rex is here working on electrical right now. That's why the lights are off. But let me show you what's going on up here. Again, hardwoods throughout. You can see that we have just a great space. This is where mainly the artwork, jewelry, silver, things like that will be up in this gallery when you come to look at it. Where Rex is working right now, you can see this big wall was put in. It gives a nice clean finished look to it. And this box and that box right there contain gallery wall. So we'll have mounted up high with cables hanging down to take pictures on. So we won't have to put in hundreds of picture hangers on this wall over here. And uh, we have all this natural light from these glass block across the front of the building. And you can see that we have just this great wide open space. And uh, it just looks so good. The hardwood floors, when I first came in, they were down. I almost cried. They look so good compared to the concrete. If anybody needs some really cool room dividers, let me know. We've got those for sale on Facebook Marketplace. Had a lot of interest. Uh, it's something for you know, moving or sizes has not worked for people. But really cool stuff right there. And then we step up into this space here. And the big thing that's been done up here is this wall was added and it looks like it's been here forever. The front here is where my office will be. <clears throat> and this is where my Friday videos behind the gavel with Jason will now be shot from now on. Uh, get some, you know, some lighting in here and uh, put down carpet for better acoustics. Uh, but this is where my office will be, set up my desk, things like that. Put a nice oriental rock carpet or two in here, cut down that echo. And then, of course, this is where we will shoot. We're going to line this wall with shelving. Put our light box right here. Amy and I were the other day looking at this one with the light box here facing towards me so that the background is all solid and no reflection and no light, which uh, if you take any kind of photography, all you know, light is great, but it gets, you have to really be careful and cognizant of what you have going on there. <clears throat> so that is really kind of it in a nutshell. You see we already have things in here for our art auction. That's one consignment. We'll have other things coming in here starting next week. Um, <laughs> so they're moving stuff in. See we have our flower vases in here, cleaning supplies and some hardware that and tools in this room. And the utility rooms around the corner. But that is it. What does Rhonda say there with my glasses on? You can shoot between two ferns at a gavel, which is... Yeah, I wonder if I can get Zach to be a host, guest on that show. Between 
I should, between two gavels, that's what I should do. I should get two big gavels, I have one, and between two gavels uh, with Jason. That might be the direction we go. That could be a lot of fun. Thanks, Fonda. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to figure out my backdrop, actually. We'll have the artwork or a, uh, like the back wall of the Chiefs when they have all the logos and stuff or something else. But again, we're really excited about it. This week's video is kind of short. Obviously, uh, I'm more concerned about getting the space ready than finding guests and <laughs> preparing for that right now. So hopefully in a couple weeks, we'll go back to our regular Fridays where we have guests from all over the world to talk about antiques, art, appraisals, estates, and anything else that I deem interesting. Um, but yeah, so we got the lighting. Oh, the other thing I didn't mention before is the track lighting here. We have track lighting to go up and uh, the this, this ceiling we kept black, that one we kept white. So I have black track for in there, white track for in here. We have no track for in there, even though it has a green light, green ceiling. I thought that was fun. Stacy loves it. Amy kind of doesn't. But, you know, we'll see how it goes for a while. But thank you all so much for watching and supporting us. Again, super excited about where the space is turning out. It's looking great. Excited, excited to start working here and really get going to be able to serve you guys better. Whether you're a buyer or seller with us, the new space is going to be so much better. Let me turn this around real quick. You can see looking out that, like, you know, the work guys, the van's right there, and my truck is right there. Super easy to load stuff in and out. So, have signs coming in. The vinyl should be going on in a week or so, and then have to get permits for the big sign out front. But thank you all so much for watching. Have any questions? Let us know. Post them below. Share this with your friends or family. I hit the like button, the, the heart button, all that kind of fun stuff. Appreciate all the support. And uh, have a great weekend. Go Chiefs. We're all excited about back-to-back. -back. They run it back to the game. I'll see if they can actually finish the deal on Friday, Sunday. I believe they can. I believe they win by 10+. plus. I just think they're a better team than Tampa. Otherwise, have a great day and have a great weekend. We'll see you guys next week.